What up, gamers? Welcome back, and yes, I say back, to SCP Fragmented Minds. I actually played this game about two years ago, and it's honestly come such a long way. Actually, to be honest, this is nothing like the demo I played back then. For those who aren't familiar, SCP Fragmented Minds is a single player and apparently multiplayer SCP action horror game, and it's set on an SCP containment facility on Mars. Now, truthfully, this demo makes it feel like more of a survival horror, which I actually love. At its current state, it's pretty deep, and the demo here showcases that quite well. Now, I love SCP games because the potential is pretty much infinite. There's so much you can do with this universe, and I especially love the passion behind it. Now, in this game, I believe, at least from the demo, the focus is on SCP-610, which is an absolutely horrifying thing. Anyway, Fragmented Minds just put up their Kickstarter campaign, so if you like what you see and you want to support, there's a link down below. Check out the project and back it. I mean, if you're a fan of the SCP Foundation in general, I'm sure this will be well worth it for you. And yes, apparently you can pet SCP-939, which I don't know why anyone would want to, but if you need a reason to back the project, there you go. Also, this demo I'm about to play for you is available on Steam, so that link will also be down below. Sit back, relax, and or grab a hold of something tight as we're jumping in. Hey, we're nearing the main security gate for this zone. I'm not sure why the zone is sending off different lockdown signals, but we can find out what's wrong with the gate control system, which is near our current position, and will allow us to end the lockdown and use the tram to proceed through the section to the center of the facility. Is this where I was in cryosleep? Is this whole container for me? There's no way, right? That'd be ridiculous. Oh, I got a utility axe. Nice. Oh, this sounds horrible. Given the backstory that I know right now, this is horrifying. This is like uh, GTFO. You know how you kind of wake out of cryo sleep in the, the roller coaster down to hell? That's kind of what I feel like right now. SCP facility, I'm just woken up. Everything is supposed to be peachy when I wake up, but it's not. It looks like that welder might be useful to us later. Thank you. Are you supposed to be an AI? Because you don't sound like it. Uh, you can use the welder to cut or weld specific interactable objects, which can be identified by the welding icon. Okay. Is that also on the weapon wheel? It is. I, I literally hear people screaming. Do you guys hear that? Can I break these open? Ah. Uh, so given this is also kind of action oriented, feels kind of nice. Can I? Oh my god, I can slide. Can I slide cancel? Yes, I can. What was that? What is happening there? Oh, is that the train? Oh, that's the train. Okay. The door to the gate oh. control is just up ahead. Okay. I mean, you know, something I thought of is we're on Mars, which is smart, right? You can relocate the entities, if possible, to an external planet, and then it won't be as much of a threat on humanity as if they were staying on Earth. But the problem I see is that if there are things that can bend time, you know, there are SCPs out there that want, one's like a tectonic plate. There's others that can build up. Oh my God. Unreal Engine 5 just scared the shit out of me, dude. I thought that I thought there was something standing right there moving through that glass. That scared me. Anyway, as I was saying, you know, there has to be stuff that's a threat to the universe. Uh-oh. Did my flashlight run out? There it is. Okay. Looks like the door's been sealed. Let's see if we can find a place to use that welder to get inside. Oh, I see. I see already. Hit. I suck. Uh, okay, well that didn't work. Aha! Aha! That, that's all it takes? Oh, for the vent, okay. <laughs> I was like, for a security door? That's insane. There we go. I mean, this is still kind of a security problem. But anyway, like if there's things that could th pose a threat to the universe, I don't think it matters if it's on Mars, you know what I mean? You can only relocate so much. And eventually you just kind of have to accept that humanity is not going to survive in this universe. Oh. Oh. What the fuck are you? God damn it. No. My battery ran out way too quick, dude. I need it right now. I need this right now. It's 
whispering to me. Dude. Is there enti an entire, like, species, like, multiple breeds of, like, the 939 guys that just mimic spider webs in here is actually kind of interesting. Why would the, did we carry a spider over from Earth? Whoa. This place has been abandoned for a while. Plug me into the main control console and let's see why. Okay. Is this you? Uh, how do I do that? There we go. Okay, let's see what we're dealing with here. This zone seems to be experiencing multiple system failures. There's a gas leak in the ventilation control room and a massive power shortage. If we're still planning to use the tram system in order to get to the center of the facility, we'll need to fix both systems to end the lockdown and clear the way. We appear to be closer to the gas leak. I'll mark it on your map. Oh. Okay, uh, do you by chance have any batteries for me? Because I'm out now. I'm on my last one. I need to use this sparingly. Uh-oh. It's combat. Uh, using a one-handed weapon or no weapon at all while blocking, press to perform a shield bash. Okay. I've played, like, medieval fighting games before. I know how this works. Very, uh, low-tech for a Mars outpost, you know? I see it. Sorry, guys. It's very dark. I can't see anything because I don't want to waste the battery. In seconds, the sun is beating like drums in all hearts. What? In seconds, the sun is beating like drums. Mm. Oh, it has a... Oh. I can be sneaky, sneaky. Interesting take on the S... I, there's another SCP game I know that's been out for a bit. Uh, is it Pandemic? That's kind of like a zombie shooter. I don't know, man. I always... Oh, God! Stop it! Get off! Get off! Please get off! Stop it! Oh. Okay, it's dead. Jesus Christ, dude. He came all the way up here? Now, this little meter I have underneath my health, is that my flashlight energy? Because it's gone up a little bit. Do I need... Did I need the batteries? An extremely long-lasting illumination device used to mark points of interest to provide light in emergency situations. Okay. At least I have two flares. Okay. It's a little fucky. I'm not going in the blood-stained vent. Out of your mind? I gotta go, don't I? Very interesting mix of horror games here. Oh, did I miss it? Did I miss whatever it was? Good. I don't want to see it. You can traverse quickly by pressing Q to your gra- Oh! It's grapple hooks. Dude, I'm playing Zelda. This zone is heavily locked down, but that control console will let us override the container rail system to bypass the security doors. Oh, I made it. I didn't think I could make that jump. Log, T to open. Okay, good morning, Jacob. I've been growing a bit concerned over the last few days about the shipments going to our friends one section over in the E-Link station. I know it's supposed to be a self-contained zone, but there hasn't been a single order for supplies in nearly five days, which is extremely odd. I sent off an email to their supply chain director, but they have yet to hear back. Oh, I can craft? What? Oh, it's 2046. It really is in the future. Frame control code. Here we go. 4631. Now, where do I put that? Lockdown in effect. Wow. Hostile entities detected. Safety shelter. Is that where I'm going? Or wait. Is that my objective? To get to safety? Or am I supposed to be like figuring out what's going on? I could swim in this water, right? There's a door. Oh my god. What? I opened the door, but I can't get in it. Oh god. Oh, this is bad. What is it? I'm sorry. What are you? What are you supposed to be? Should I kill it? It's not talking like the other one. Oh, 
the combat what are you that is not i'm assuming like clearly this is an scp game on mars so we're not gonna have the the typical guys like 173 hopefully actually in the original demo he was definitely here uh i gotta heal wow that didn't do much at all yep i see him this is a little horrifying are the red lights supposed to signify the emergency oh i got up here i had no idea my parkour can reach <gasps> copper wire iron beam phone what can i craft with this oh i need a lot more never mind just for a grenade hey buddy relax a little bit huh God! No! Oh, gee. Oh, Jesus! Oh, God, it's locked! It's locked! Ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Oh. Woo! Did I do it? Oh. Shit. What was the code? 4631. Okay. I've overridden the cargo container overhead. Jump in. There it is. Okay. Woo! Okay. Oh, is it? Oh. I'm picking up movement ahead. It might be more of those SCP-3199 instances. Be careful. 3199? 3199. What is that one? See me you can't see me up here i can't fight these things dude like the, I, I have to run it's just gotta be way more calculated i gotta fight one-on-one -on -one. i can definitely do that but more than one absolutely not who am i leonidas storage though may have batteries tape recorder hmm. <gasps> this is a weapon Ooh, it's more powerful. Okay. Now, is there going to be a system, like an RPG system for me to level up stuff or what? Oh, the website. It's a government website. It's a government website. The SCP Foundation. Can I? Oh, I wish I could. 001, 002, 11, 14. Dude. Okay, hold on. I don't know much about like the core history of the SCP Foundation, right? But it's a government site. So this is a government acknowledged. I mean, I guess it would have to be. It's just so weird to think about. Okay, this is an interesting way to show. The hell are you looking at? 966? What is that? It's a Euclid. Dream Hunters. <gasps> oh, are these the invisible guys? Sudden violent human deaths related to sleep deprivation in order to find a neutralized. The four specimens, the three males designated 9661, 9663, and four, and one female designated 9662, acquired by the foundation, must be contained within a 10 by 10 room made of steel lined with lead located on site something. Only two digits. Or 113. Gotta be an early site. Two security cameras with infrared filters and infrared sensitive uh, sensitive film are to be installed inside the room. Each specimen. Oh my god, dude. Now, is this a hint at what could potentially this is just the demo. Is this a hint at what could potentially be in the game later on? Oh god, what is this? Agent explores behind front desk, enters hotel manager's office where A26 sits on a shelf besides hotel ledgers. It removes DVD from 826 and exits through office door into research room. What the fuck? Dude, that is so cool! Potential for these games, man. Oh, he left. Wow. <laughs> it's so 
easy. It's so easy, isn't it, dumbass? Look at this joke of an SCP. Get out of here, dude. What are you? It's like an overgrown chick. Overgrown chick. Little baby bird. Will you block? Why isn't he blocking? Ah! Good. Where's your friend? Ah! Jesus, you scared me. Ah! There you are. Okay, I am really weak now. God, I have five health. I need a health kit, please. Someone needs to give me health kit. Where the health? Where am I going, dude? This is the oh, gas distribution Jesus. zone. Your suit doesn't have a built-in filter, so it won't be able to handle the gas. But there should be some emergency filters nearby. Oh boy. Oh boy. Cryo grenade? What is that thing? <gasps> is that 939? Oxygen filter. There we go. Got charged. Apparently, apparently running charges my flashlight. I noticed standing still doesn't do anything. You got to be moving. It's like that uh, the swim charge fins from Subnautica. The concentration of gas in this section is much higher than normal. So filters Reach will degrade quickly. Room. Okay, so you need it's... to move through the control room as fast as possible. Right, so it's up here. Oh, is this it? Disable gas flow. Oh, I'm going to die. Disable gas okay. flow. Now enable the ventilation. Enable the power air. surge must have tripped the breaker. Oh, get Let out. Let me scan the electricals oh, to see more. where the issue is. Oh, you're Found pissing it. me off. Reset the breaker, but keep an eye on your suit filters. Is this it? Did I get it? Okay. So apparently I can just equip all of them at once. Uh oh. Nine three nine. No. Am I good now though? Please. Like I, I need to be, be. I need to breathe. Okay. I am out of oxygen filters. I did. I was not aware that I could put them all in at once. It's not intuitive. Shit. The ventilation noises must have attracted an SCP-939 pack. Yeah. There are four damaged pipes you'll need to find and weld shut. But be careful not to make too much noise, or you will alert the pack. This ain't happening, man. Just want to let you know this is not going to happen. How the hell did 939 get on Mars? We transported them. Listen for the leaks to find the remaining three damaged pipes. Sure thing. I should not make any noise, right? They can't get up here, right? I'm comforting myself, right? Oh, no one's near me, so. That's one. Okay. Oh, there's one over here. Ah. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't know. They're on the second floor, though. God, I hate 939. The voice is nowhere near as That's intimidating chill. as SCP containment breaches. get into a single tussle. Shit. Shit. Jesus. Yeah! Nope. Oh, it's just me. I'm about to go around for this one. There it is. Okay. Easy. That's three. Head back to the control room. Okay. 
No. Oh my god. Dude, it's not even like mimicking human speech. It's like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It's like, like blowing bubbles in water and hearing speech inside the bubbles. Not that the thing blowing bubbles in the water is actually talking, but the sounds kind of, we recognize patterns there. You know what I mean? God, dude, they're everywhere. Where is this godforsaken control room? <laughs> I found it. The lockdown's been lifted. The quickest way to the power station is through the nearby container warehouse. <sighs> Reach cargo distribution. Okay, man, this place, this game has got me going all over the place, man. Nine. We need to use these containers to find a way up to the warehouse office, but stay clear from the security system. Oh. You know what? I have plenty of batteries. I'm just going to use it. I need multiple. Wow. I don't have a med kit or nothing. Oh, hello. My friend, you've made it pretty far. I got to be honest. That was one of ours. Yeah, probably. He dead as fuck now, boy. He deader than hell. <laughs> God, I have some awful tea. All right, I'm recording this for anybody who comes through here for the same reason I did. When I woke up in sector four, nobody else from my squad remained in stasis except for one. But if I tried to, sh to thaw them, it would have immediately killed them. It was chaos. So many decaying bodies and blood. It looked like a war zone that I had discovered many months after the battle and already ended. All of them were trying to escape for the same reason, and so many like us were left behind. Through the facility warning system, I discovered that these, this sector's reactor system was overloading and had to be stabilized or else this entire section would have depressurized from the explosion and let out God knows what. There was no time when I arrived to do a procedural shutdown, so instead I shorted the system, which seemed to stop any immediate danger until the pressure builds up enough. But by that point, I'll be long gone since one of them tore through my suit and I've already noticed a scar forming. So the rest is up to you. Sorry, man. What is this? Ammo box? Oh, do you have a gun, man? Creature took his gun. I don't know how I feel about that, to be honest. I would really, really, I could really go for some health packs right now. You know what I mean? I just want one, maybe two, depending on the damage, you know? Health, please. A phone, a phone that doesn't work. I don't have enough scraps to build anything. Do I? No. Yeah, please, goddamn health kit. I'm PC fan. What am I, Linus Tech Tips? Activate that terminal. The reactor system is just in the next zone. I don't like what I just heard. I activated. Oh, enter container. Okay. So weird. What's up with these shipping containers? Oh God. Don't shoot me, bro. I'm picking up some very strange readings from the nearby areas around the reactors. Okay. Strange readings. Always good. I'm currently charging my flashlight. So don't mind me. I'm assuming it's the big, big freaky looking monster I saw in the trailer. Is that what I'm up against next? I don't have, I still have only five health. I can't believe I've made it this far. Oh no. What? This zone has been infected by SCP-610. Even minor contact with that flesh can spread the infection. We need to be extremely Whoa. cautious. Oh. Okay. I can't go that way. This is bad. That's what the flesh things is. I'm not going to be able to fight that thing. I, I actually think I need... <gasps> what? When did I get this? Oh, oh this is the stuff uh, from Stray. It came from Mars. It sounds like this late stage SCP-610 infection has put the reactors under severe stress. Get us to the central control station. 
Okay, but I can touch this stuff? Like, you, you made it seem like I can't come in contact with it. Okay, I'm just gonna go. Uh -huh. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I guess I have to. Yeah, this is the stuff from Stray and Ghost Exile. I guess I brought it. Dude, I'm in the esophagus of something. Oh my god. Wait, stop moving. There's a mobile variant Ooh. of SCP-610 ahead. That pistol won't do much, so try to avoid it. Dude. Oh, it's an infected person. Okay, I guess I could just sneak past him. Jesus. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Am I an idiot? It recovers health. I am so stupid. There it is. I'm full health. Excellent. I had no idea that that meat would recover. I thought there was going to be some kind of like eating, like hunger or thirst mechanic, and then I completely forgot about it. Oh boy. SCP 610. Look at that. What? SCP 610 infected individuals and a converted environment. Visible are an animate infected, an inanimate infected, a non human infected, and several unknown infected. Due to the vast area of infection SCP 610 covers, containment is impossible. Isolation of the area has proved far more effective, and permission has been granted by the Russian government to establish a perimeter to keep people out of these areas under the guise of military operations. Should any organism displaying traits consistent with 610 be sighted near this perimeter, uh, then the established protocol requires it to be engaged at range with small arms until immobile, then dispatched using incendiary weapons from as great a distance as possible. So this Siberia. Okay, so we at by 2046 have relocated it to Mars or has it spread? If it containment's impossible, this must mean it's spread, right? Dude, that's the ultimate containment breach. Multiple planets are infected. Oh my God. Hey, look. The flesh that hates. Dude. What a crazy SCP. SCP-610 appears to be a contagious skin disease at first, with symptoms including rash, itching, and increased skin sensitivity. Within three hours, the disease will cause blemishes resembling heavy scar tissue to form in the chest and arms area, spreading to the legs and back within an additional hour, consuming the victim completely within five hours hours exposure to higher temperatures vastly decreases the time for the contagion to spread and complete infections have been recorded occurring in as little as five minutes after the completion of the infection occurs the victim's life functions will cease for approximately three minutes after which time it will restart at two to three times the activity rate of a normal human Following this, the scar tissue on the victims will start to move of its own accord and grow at a rapid rate. It's a massive scar tissue, endless scar tissue building. Conditions, an infected individual will cease moving and place itself in a location it deems suitable where it's, it roots itself. Observation of life infected by SCP-610 by staff is impossible. Those infected with the disease immediately seek out aid as natural human impulse resulting in unintended infections. Those infected pass the scar tissue phase actively and aggressively attempt to infect anyone approaching them within an undefined area. Well, I've been walking near these guys. That's not cool. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Sneaky. Sneak by bad guys. This is what we do. He's facing the other way conveniently. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, here we go. Also, oh, I see green. Green is good. Why give me all these weapons if I can't use them? Could I potentially kill one? I feel like if I made any noise, all of them will follow me though. Talk to me, goose. Food and the battery. That's good. Now I'm starting to get, I actually quite enjoy the limited amount of items that I get because it allows me to explore other options instead of running and gunning, you know what I mean? That's how horror games should work. You should have limited supply of stuff because otherwise it's just so easy. 
Another office. God, how how I know these SCPs aren't loose all the time, but this is so deep in the facility. Imagine working here and this is your office. How far you have to travel to get here is insane. I would hate this job, dude. Coolant. We need to flow. find a way to clear those coolant pipes. I've marked a storage crate nearby that may have something we could use. Okay, is this where I came from? Maybe it is. This guy's blocking my way. There's like biomass inside these containers. Yeah, no way I can do anything here. I have to sneak past this guy. I could lure him out, right? But I, I think this might be where I came from. Is it not? So I'm assuming what I need to do is alert him and then bring him back over here, do a loopsie loo, and then keep running, right? Go away! Ugh, I don't like it, dude. Ooh, will he stay? I think I got him stuck. Hello? Okay. Okay, 6101. Go die. They came so quickly, yet they were too late. I heard uh, their screams even over the reactors humming. Nobody else was left here to tell them what it was they were about to face. It probably came from the R&D section some poor soul uh, was supposed to study. It must have been infected by it and brought it over to our sector sec section, I guess, uh, trying to flee after hearing about the incident. The reactors were the perfect place for it to want to go since it has an affinity for heat. But even I didn't know it could turn people this quickly. But I managed to, to construct one of the prototype weapon systems I've been working on. I've marked this location so anybody with access to the facility network can find it. This is the only way to stop it from spreading. Is it a fire a flamethrower? All of them are gone and I suppose it was my inaction that caused their death. So I hope this last action can help make up for it. No, it will never make up for it. But you can die with some honor, I guess. Use it sparingly, but don't let us suffer any longer. <gasps> what is this? It is a flamethrower. Yeah. There are only five pipes. Burn flesh. Oh, yeah. So do I have to burn the guys? There it is. Missed. <laughs> oh God! Ah! One's dead. Two's dead. How did they die so fast? Oh. Ah! 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 Oh. oh man, I messed up. One more. One more, baby. Come on. There it is. It needs ventilation. I'm an idiot. Thank God I have one more. Jesus. Almost botched that, man. That did it. We should yes. now be able to activate the coolant system. Okay. Door right here, maybe? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Toggle coolant. Now, all we have to do is reset the system, and the power will stabilize. The manual pressure regulation appears to be offline, oh, and the Jesus. reactors can't stabilize until the excess pressure is vented off. We'll need to manually vent each reactor group before it can be reset. <laughs> Good thing I've already killed off everything, you know? Shouldn't be an issue now. I'm pretty sure, yeah, it's on this panel, right? Yeah! The venting sequence uh -oh. will take 60 seconds. Don't let anything interrupt it. Holy mother of God, dude. Okay, this is easy. Easy. <laughs> I am a snake, dude. One more to go. Holy mo- ah! 
I'm fucking dead. Oh, hey. He's stuck. Everyone's stuck. Yes. I think I glitched it because I'm like, they can't tell where I'm at. <laughs> Reactors online. The power will take time to stabilize, but now we need to return to the tram and deactivate the sector lockdown. How am I supposed to do that with all these people? Hello? Oh, I didn't have to do it myself? Nice. Sector lockdown disabled. zone of the facility is clear and we can take the tram all the way there i don't know what we'll find once we get there but i hope some of the remaining personnel managed to survive end of demo right no yes yeah there's no way you're not ending the demo on that on that beautiful score okay yep what's equipment lab uh Whoa. Woo, hello. Oh yeah, SCP stop. I guess I just don't understand what is this? Is just this a place to like train or like understand the mechanics of the game? I mean, it's pretty, pretty neat. This kind of reminds me of Dead Drop, dude. What? Dude, this hideout is dope. I love this. This is so cool. I guess I'm just not exactly sure what I'm supposed to be, like who I am as the character here okay all right i've had enough fun with this demo this was pretty lengthy and i'm rather impressed with the length of that demo it really showcased like pretty much all them as it's a demonstration i personally don't like action uh games that much uh and what i mean by that is like guns blazing fighting hordes of zombies and stuff like that that's why my interest in scp pandemic has been hindered or i don't really want to right now because that's the state of the game this one on the other hand it definitely gives you a survival horror feel like coming across the items i needed was actually hard like i had to pace myself properly in order to be able to survive what i did uh, and the option to, you know, run around and charge a little bit of your flashlight just to have enough to see is cool. I like the ass. I feel like it's balanced pretty well uh, to be a, a genuine like survival horror game and not just a run and gun shoot everything you see. I can imagine with this, there's a lot of possibilities to creatively explore with 610 and uh, you can make some giant monsters and shit. You can get like the flood you know, from Halo. As long as we're not, I, I would say, I think it would ruin it if it was just a zombie shooter. If it was just horde after horde after horde, wave after wave, you know. But I personally have not felt that from this at all. So if you enjoyed what you've seen, you can hit the like button and such, all that nonsense for me. But if you want to support the game, the Kickstarter is up. That's linked down below. But show your support. I love SCP games. And this one was pretty damn good. Anyway, once again, it's nap time for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.